Hey guys, and welcome back to Terra Tech with me, Tenzin. How are you guys doing today? I'm doing pretty good. I hope you guys are having a good day too. Uh, so, picking up where we left off in the last episode, as per usual. <laughs> uh, remade the tech. Um, I kind of like it a little bit more. I'm using those straight bike wheels now. Uh, I just have two of them on the sides here with the radar. Uh, the angled bike wheels, and then we have the... F um, that other wheel. I don't know. The very first wheel we got. But it looks like we haven't been slowed down because it seems like whatever's pushing us, like if you have the faster wheels pushing you, it seems like the whole vehicle does moves faster, right? So that's kind of nice. But like we said in the last episode, or we were talking about in the last episode, we're going to try and finish or get uh, Hawkeye to grade three. So I'm not going to waste any time. We're just going to get right into it. Uh, obviously, we have to kill... Uh, adventure guys a bunch of other stuff but hopefully we can uh, we also got in the last episode if you guys didn't watch it we got the uh, what is it Hawkeye gas fuel tank and jet the, or jet engine so that should be really cool uh, we hopefully I'll find the rotors uh, I think that's all we're missing, the three different types of rotors. So these Megaton Cannons are doing some work, but they're not doing as much work as I was kind of hoping they'd do. Ah, I can't, no. That'd be a lie saying that they're not doing anything. Because they just ripped that guy right in half. <laughs> so Venture, we just need to find seven more. That's the Venture AI unit. Oh, let's hang it up there. Uh, sweet. Uh, we are we stuck? Yep. We're high centered. You gotta bounce your way down. So I guess that's the one downfall of this machine. It's just because we put it so close to the ground. But we could technically rip these guns off the side and put more of these down. But, uh, I don't know. Let's go kill this guy. Uh, sorry. The reason I said nice for our next quest, because it's uh, a Hawkeye quest, point of interest. But that means we're going to run into more Hawkeye guys. Meaning, there's a good chance of us getting some new Hawkeye tech. Are we high-centered again? Oh, we are. Huh. Just trying to think here, peeps. Uh, like that. You know, that's the thing too, is that you want to make a vehicle that actually looks half decent. And then they go on and they make it so you can't. Because <laughs> these wheels are neat. They're like, they're really nice and... With all the snap points they have and stuff like that. But they just... I wish you could like adjust the lengths of them and stuff like that. That, because you just can't get the the proper angle. You sometimes you really want on them. So we'll add. Oops. Oh, we move that one. Did we put it like that? Yes. Okay. Hopefully that. Helps alleviate our problems. Uh, looks like we might have to move these two guns. Mm, running into problems already, wow. <laughs> We're just a couple minutes into the episode. So, there we go. Uh, yeah, we'll just move it up like that. Hopefully that does it. I guess we should have checked first at hand. Oh. Uh. Are we sitting on something? No. Oh. What it be to be. Oh. You know what? No. She just doesn't want to move, guys, so we'll just take this. Come on, snap lower. There. 
Fair enough. This is our, we're moving through the mountain tech, uh, cry all you want, we're still gonna do it this way. <laughs> the only thing we have to worry about is tipping over. Yeah, this is actually working out pretty good. It's not underneath the shield though, or in the shield, so... Somebody cherry picks it, it might be a problem, or might have a big problem, but... That's interesting. Do you notice the two that we had sideways here? They're actually... Oh. Okay. Um, they're actually... Or all four of them are actually turning sideways. Or forward. They're not... Uh, they're not restricted by their movement. Like some of the other ones. Like the Venture Long Rifles. They kind of don't like to be turned forwards or anything like that, so if they're too close to the other ones. Ooh, there we go. There's the tail wing. Yeah, we definitely need to recharge because... Oh, actually, it's not that bad. I thought we were going to be worse off than that. That thing looks cool. Jeez. This will add a couple more pieces and we're almost there. We'll be there. And we're almost... Oh, the next point of interest is another Hawkeye one. So maybe we'll, while we have this up, we'll just go like that. No. <laughs> there. Just until we get out of the... Or do you think it'll just... No, no, because side one will just bring us up more. We'll leave it like that. Um, a little bit of charge. Then we're out of here. That's the one thing that kind of sucks. Is that, you know, I always want to show you guys, um, like, everything there is about the game so you guys can make an educated, uh, decision on whether or not you like it, whether or not you want to play it, you know, everything like that. But it's like, okay, well, I have to keep the episodes to a certain distance, so then it's like, wow, I'm making a million episodes, right, just to get a couple <laughs> little ways ahead. So I hope you guys are enjoying them, um, and not mad because it takes, you know, two or three episodes to actually get anywhere. Uh, hopefully our charge time gets cut down eventually. Um... I'm still hoping they put it like a different type of uh, solar panel in here. Yeah, actually, TerraTech devs, if you guys are watching, can we please get a larger uh, solar panel, like from GEO or something like that? This one where we only have to deploy one instead of a million. <laughs> uh, while we're here, let's do this. Instead of... Instead of trying to pick up, or pick up the SCU unit over and over and over... See, that makes it a lot easier now that we've spotted that or figured out that one out. Took a while, but we got there. <laughs> Three or four restarts, you know, that's pretty much it. <laughs> I'm still super so stoked because we're oh, we're getting so close to being done and getting everything we have and then the tank deployment will happen actually and then you know uh, looking at uh, harvesting how to properly or the fastest way to harvest but honestly I don't know because we still have the GEO ones up here right the jelly harvester and stuff like that but I actually making it like trading in the parts that you don't need seems to be fairly pretty much uh, fairly quick and the fastest money you can really make. This guy's gonna die in like two seconds. Disco. Okay. They're always ambushing us. Oh, that looks like a 
No, that's a shotgun on the front. Oh. Okay, that's a, Oh. Come on. Oh, there we go. Invader. Okay, we gotta back up and deploy the SU. Hopefully we can get this done. There's the tail wing again. Um, hopefully we can get this done properly this time before he actually comes over to attack us. We have 10 seconds. From the point he falls down on us. It's just that he stresses me out. <laughs> I'm making sure we got plenty this time. Oh, we didn't cover the SCU unit, but... Okay. <laughs> Hopefully that wasn't too loud in everybody's ears. Uh, I love some, like how they explode sometimes. Because like, the parts scatter so far. Sometimes. That's like, okay, and then you're driving over there by that rock in the distance. And there's a part sitting there. It's like, where'd that come from? But it was because of you. Okay. I'm going to play 152 pickup. And I screwed this one up. Okay. Let's call it that. And the other reason I, that we're really stopping is because of the Hawkeye stuff. Um, next point of interest is a GEO. We need four more ventures. So we could run over to this question mark here that could be venture. Let's just kind of turn. Yeah, the problem is at a distance. Oh, I don't even know if you guys can see this cursor. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, but if you can, yeah. I was the top right or the north on our map there it shows a question mark or the radar now that's directly behind us but yeah um the hell was i talking about uh sorry <laughs> oh, oh yeah venture and gso they look pretty much the same at a distance so it's sometimes hard to actually tell which one's which what's going on here Oh, there's something underneath us. So yeah, that's kind of how you get rid of the invaders, right? Set up everything, set up your um, your solar panels, repair bubbles, usually, and shield bubbles. Uh, if you're when we were playing the other the other version, the shield bubbles were big enough that you could actually just back up. And, yeah, there's a couple of, nice, nice, nice. You could actually just back up to the SCU unit and your, the shield bubble would cover it, right? And then you just charge yourself. But, we've changed it just a little bit here. Some kind of bracket. I'm sure we have the bracket, but. Just in case we don't. Oh, we're gonna win this battle. Everybody's a sitting duck here. <laughs> oh, what the heck? <laughs> it's like a little mouse. Okay. Ah, oh, one shy. One shy of finishing off the venture hunter. Let's just drive around here really quickly. Uh, we'll inspect this tech over here. Because that could be... What, uh, looks like venture? Yeah, it is. Oh no, it's GSO. Dag, nab it. Okay, let's go... We gotta head 
towards the exclamation point, but there's those two other red dots there. We'll I'll check them out really quickly. Hopefully one of them is Venture and that'll give us... That's GSO that just landed in the background. You can always tell that because there's a base there. The shields. Um, that second one Venture? That just came down the hill? No. Venture wants to hide from us today. Alright, let's go to the exclamation point. And hopefully run across a venture there. Where do you guys want me to? Nah, I think that's all GSO. Oh, there's a venture. You can tell just by the cab. Come on. Done. Okay, more wing. Oh, we're so close. So, so close. Look at that tech hunter. 50 techs it wants us to hunt down now. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're going to go to the exclamation point. Like, there's no way we're going to hunt down 50 techs in a couple of minutes, so... It won't happen this episode. <laughs> But maybe we can run into the other invader this episode, or find another Hawkeye point of interest. Uh, is that Hawkeye just to the left? Oh no, it's just a bunch of rocks. <laughs> a GEO with a little bit of venture. A little bit of lights. Yeah. I really like the Megaton Cannons. They pack quite the punch. I was like, where's the cap? <laughs> These G, uh, see the, the GEO new cabs? I really like the look of them. I think they're called the Boss Cabs. Come on. Should be killing these guys, no problem. Should rip right through them. Like a butter through knife. Or knife through butter. <laughs> like a butter through knife. <laughs> okay. Uh, what's the next one? Next one is. We'll just keep moving really quickly. Back just cracked. <laughs> uh, maybe we'll get lucky. At least with Hawkeye, I'm pretty sure we should be able to... Um, like when you get all their tech, we should be able to make like a, a helicopter that can actually attack now. Haha, uh -huh, you don't stand a chance. <laughs> Come on. We're leaving so much stuff behind, but that's not the worst thing in the world. Just trying to motor us along here. Like I said, we are going to try and get to um, max out great, uh, max out uh, Hawkeye today, so. Or in this, yeah, today, this episode. I wish if the Megaton cannons actually fired faster, we would definitely be running a lot more of them. Just because then we can, we'd be able to rip through anybody that was in front of us and move on, right? So, oh, this is Venture, is that, yeah, that's two vehicles. Venture is so easy. <laughs> as soon as we hit them once with the Megaton, they're just. Uh, just like that. 
Not to mention they have so many gas tanks on them now. Like some of these some of these bots that are coming in. Enemy's waves destroyed. We're motoring. <laughs> what are we? Eleven out of fifty. So yeah, maybe if we make this episode a little bit longer, we might be able to get all fifty. Or there we go. I don't want to drive away too fast. Not kill him. That's the battery, huh? I thought we had it already, but if we don't, we do now. Ah. Oh, come on. Oh, we have to recharge anyways. Oh, shield bubble. Okay, how big is theirs? Ah. Oh. <laughs> Venture stuff is so small now. It hurts. Freaking hurts, man. Hopefully that's enough for chargers. Okay, well, screwed that one up. But at least everything's up and going, right? So we'll just go over here really quickly. We'll kill, destroy these guys. So let's say we haven't got this one before. Oh, that's the speedometer. How many are we at? 14 out of 15. Oh! Hawkeye's next quest. Nice. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. Charger's fast. <laughs> I'm impatient. Impatient today. Okay. There's that. I think we got everything else. Yeah, it says there's a remote charger over there. Do we have any... No, we don't. So maybe we should grab a coat. Go, oh, just run over there. Oh, come on, get out of the way. Let's run over there, grab that remote charger. Just because we don't have the venture one yet. Where is it? It was just pointing over here, wasn't it? Or did we just destroy it? Okay, well, can't find it, so moving on. If it fell and we didn't have to find it, then we can just buy it, right? So. Ba, 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 da. Holy cow, this, these guys were a little bit further away than what I expected them to be. Um, it'd be nice to know what just crashed down over here. Uh, GSL. Okay. And Copper's taken. So it's full of shotguns. We just knocked off the railgun yet on the top there. Doesn't stand a chance. See, they said that this is going to be a... Should turn into a multiplayer game, and when it does... Like, if they have, like, a PvP or something like that, oh, like, the text you're gonna see, it's gonna be, because I've seen, you know, I'm sure you guys have, well, you're watching my channel, so I'm sure you're watching other people's channels, too. But I've seen some of these guys, and they've made some massive base, like, mobile base slash, I don't even, like, it's like an aircraft carrier, but... Now we gotta go over here and kill this guy. But yeah, I don't even know how some of these. Maybe that's what the railgun's for. Because the railgun, I don't know. We're gonna have to do tests in the end. Because we can do it, but I, I think the railgun. Oh, okay, sorry. 
Let's come back to this. Congratulations, you've reached the current maximum license for a Hawkeye. There are still lots of new blocks to discover, but you won't gain any more XP on Hawkeye grades until you've... Okay, so we're at grade 3. We've maxed out um, Hawkeye. But that means we still have to go looking for all the other tech. Unless we can buy it. Let's let's see. If we can buy it, then we'll go. I'll go over to this our little selling trade station point, and I'll just sell a buttload of parts, and we'll start building um, flyers in the next one. Especially Hawkeye. They, well, they will only be Hawkeye. Okay, yeah, that's it. We can buy them, right? Oh, yeah. Okay, let's buy one just to take a look at it. No, don't suck it up. That looks so awesome. Look at that thing. That is awesome. Let's see. The whole shift it should spin for us. Ooh, okay. Oops. Bought that. <laughs> a little big. Oh, but there's a snap point on top of it, so that means you can do multiples. Let's see what's this. Oh, that's like a tail one. Oh man, alright. So. Uh, flyers on the next one. Max out. <laughs> Hawkeye flying machines. This is gonna be fun. This next one's gonna be awesome. Alright, so if you guys like this episode, please leave a like. Uh, leave a comment. If you haven't already, please subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.